<laughs> we, we both started in Texas, and I hear that we have something in common, which I did not know I had in common with anyone. You sang at amateur wrestling events, the yeah. anthem. Yeah. I did too. Oh my God. And I was, I didn't know anyone did that. It was like $100 to yeah. do it. Same. And I was like, I could use $100. And I knew nothing about it. Yeah. And you show up and it was crazy. Yeah. I mean, I would do it every Saturday night. And like my oh friends my would come and we would get to like go back backstage. Like it was like yeah. a gym, like yeah. a crappy gym. <laughs> yeah. But, um, but you see everybody in their personalities. They're getting pumped yeah. up backstage. Yeah. Um, no, I just have these like vivid memories, like the smell and then walking through the ropes and because you're singing it on the actual like ring. Yes. So um, the fact that you've done that as well is No one insane. told me, by the way, and I dressed, I was singing the national anthem and I was like, I don't know, it's a respectful thing. So I, I wore a black dress. I wore like, I look nice. And, yeah. I, and I was like going through the ropes, like, yeah. with my, like trying to look classy. Yeah. Like it, yeah. Should have worn pants. Um, oh yeah. yeah. But well, no. learned the lesson after the first time, but I was like, oh. Yeah. I was like, yeah, I it feel was like different. Our kids, like, if they want to, you know, be in the music industry or what have you, it's like now there's TikTok and, like, ways to break in to this business. And we you just, and I were singing at all those random wrestling gigs. events to yes. cut our teeth. So. Barbecues. Yeah, yeah. anything yeah. you could, yes, yeah. Chili cook-offs. Yeah. Did a lot of those. It was my um, mother, too. I don't know if your mother was saying, but my mother would be like, Kelly, sing for him. Like, everywhere we went. Yeah. And I was like, Mom, not, nobody wants to hear me sing right now. Like, it's yeah. like, it's okay. Like, it's, yeah, she'd just be like, sing for him, baby. But anyway. Love it. But <laughs> how do you feel though, that motherhood has changed you? Because it does, just with the scheduling alone, the balance of that is so hard. Well, I had my son the week the world shut down during the pandemic. So oh. every part of his first year was us being stuck inside, which was kind of a gift because yeah. like we just got to witness every first moment with our baby and oh, not miss anything. Nice. My tour was canceled, like as uh, everything Everyone. was. Yeah. But I um, no, it was such a like beautiful silver lining to COVID like that year um, was just getting to be home with him. But I do think motherhood and like that pandemic really changed my outlook on like going out because I love to go out. I love having like girls nights, good dinners, yeah. love being in New York. But yeah. like if anyone invites me to dinner past 6 p.m., like I'm not coming. Oh, so. you you would fit in perfect. I'm like, if you invite, if somebody's like, oh, it's at nine, I'm like, have fun. Yeah. I'm like, I'll already be in bed. I have to be up at like 6 a.m. No, sir. Like I'm not 20. Like, yeah. I, yeah I, didn't, I didn't even like it when I was 20, honestly. I'm not, I've never been like the person that's like, Let's rage till 4 a.m. It's well, just not, it, every once in a while it would happen, but like. You're signing the check at like 10 p.m. That yeah, makes no it, sense. Yeah, it's like, no. We, yeah. um, every dinner I'm at, no one's there. My, my girlfriend <laughs> yeah. and I always say, oh, we're never gonna meet anyone because no one is at the restaurant when we go. It's That's six, so relatable. 6 p.m. is when I go. I'm, we call it the blue haired special. Like, there you go. We're going early. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and it's an early I'm night. I'm gonna call it the blue haired, yeah. But you know what? Then you don't have to wait. It's nice. It's not loud. I'm so old. Anyway, <laughs> let's because sometimes I it gets it. so loud, and then I'm like ruining my voice just trying to talk and have a conversation at dinner. I know I sound like a golden girl. I don't care. Lean I'm into find it. Find me an old man. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> yeah.